welcome back to my channel i'm penny i hope you're all doing really really well i've got another advent calendar unboxing and it is the opi 25 day advent calendar and it's a nail polish one and it looks like this so let's have a look yep they're all in number order obviously they are all nail polishes and as we know i like to do my nails this is what i've got on at the moment they're sort of a mix of glitter and sparkly at the moment i've got the barry m velvet matte and the, yeah i'm not sticking my fingers up and the barry m what's it called uh crystal rock the green ones so yeah um so i thought i would treat myself to the opi uh now advent calendar now i got this on very and it was 70 pounds which is expensive but i had discount codes and that sort of thing so i didn't pay all of that um, but simply be do it for 60. Yeah, found that after I bought it. So, yeah, um, yeah, I thought I'd give it a go. Like I said, it's a 25 day advent calendar and it's all nail polishes. So, let's get started. I'll show you me opening number one. It's just a push thing like this, and then you, uh, oh, there, and then we've got a nail polish. Right, now they're not full size OPI, but they're not a bad size. They're not a bad size. So this is the first one we've got. And this is, oh, it's quite pretty. It's like a brown glitter. It's like a brown, brown with like a gold glitter in it. So that's really pretty. So that's that's number one. And then number two, uh, I do like OPI nail polishes. They're really nice. They're really nice. This is, oh, just plain white. Always good to have a plain white. I don't actually have a plain white. So, yeah, that's quite good. And then we've got a a plain black. Is there glitter in there? I can't tell. It looks like it on there. Let's have a look. No, it's straight up black. It looks like a straight up black. So, yeah just black and then number four oh this is pretty we've got like a tealy green color look at that and it's like a it's almost like a pearlescent one i think yeah that's really pretty so that's nice it's day number four day number five what's this oh we've got a rapid dry top coat that's cool always like a good top coat i always find because i do my own my own nails and i do get them to last about a fortnight um and i find the best way to make them last is you can use whatever nail polish you want cheap whatever make sure your base and your top coat are good quality the better quality the top coat the longer it will last you know i mean it helps if the nail polish is really good quality as well but i do find that as long as that top coat is a good quality, you'll be all right. So, yeah, there's day number six. And that's a really pretty, what colour would you call this? It's like a peachy pink, but it's pretty. It's got glitter in it, so that's a pretty one. Not very Christmassy, though, are they yet? But let's have a look. Oh, okay, okay. I take it back. I take it back. First Christmassy shade, straight up bright red. Love that. Love that. That is absolutely stunning. Love a good red nail polish. And then we've got number eight. Oh, flicked that out, didn't I? What colour is this? It's like a grey grey with like a gold fleck in it. It's very unusual. I've never had one like that before. It's pretty though. Pretty. Number nine. Oh, we've got like a, a pinky tinge. It looks grey on there, but it's actually like a pale pink. So like for a French French tips. So yeah, that's quite nice. And then what's this? Oh, we've got a, it's like a pinky red, like a muted pinky red, but it's pretty. It's ever so nice. So yeah, we got that. So then day number 11. Oh, this is right up my street. Look at this colour. <gasps> Pearlescent, dark, bright, well, sort of a fuchsia pink. That's gorgeous. 
I love that. You'll be seeing that on my nails probably after Christmas when my hair goes back to pink instead of being red. Lilac. Love it. Love it. Love that colour. So that's really pretty. That was day number 12. Now we're on to the other side of the calendar. Day number 13. What have we got here? This is a top and base coat. I'm not a fan of top and base coats. I prefer individual ones. But that's, you know, oh, you probably use that as a base coat, not as a top coat. But use it as a base coat. So there's that. And number 40. Oh, I had this colour. I had this colour. It's stunning. I love this colour. It's like a purpley blue, dark purpley blue. It's so pretty. I had that in the full size. Used it all up. And then couldn't find it again. So I'm glad to have that one back in my collection. And this is like a, a nudie pink. That's really pretty. So that's day number 15. Now we're on day number 16. We have got... Oh, this is pretty. It's like a shimmery brown. Perfect colour for winter. Love that. Love that colour. That's gorgeous. And then we have got... Oh, this is unusual but very pretty. Like a pearlescent blue. I've got a lighter version of this. But it's from W7. But yeah, ever so pretty colour. Love that. Now day number 18. We have got... Oh, it's like a... I don't know if you can see, but it's got like all different colour glitters in. But it's like a black. So pretty. Look at that. Oh yeah, I can't wait to get that on my nails. Now day number 19... Oh, we've got another red. This is like a, a more of a cherry red. The three reds we've got, they are different. Look, oh, I don't know if you'll be able to see if I can keep hold of them. So we've got that one, that one, and that one. And they look all look the same on camera, but they're not. They're all ever so slightly different. Ever so slightly different. And then we've got day number 20, and we've got... It's like a white, but it's got like a pearlescence to it. I don't know if you can see it, if it's showing up. But that's really pretty. That one's a pretty one. Then we have got, oh, this is nice. This is like an autumnal pink. That's really pretty. They definitely uh, got a lot of the colours that I like and that I would wear on my nails in here. That's like a goldy colour. With a bit of shimmer in it. That's pretty. Then we've... Ah, okay. This is what I'd use as like a little top coat. Look, it's sort of just straight up glitter. Sort of glitter in a cleary coloured polish. That's really nice. I love that. That's gorgeous. And then day number 24. What have we got here? Oh, this is like a really... It looks black to you, but it's like a deep plum. Really deep plum, really nice colour. Really, really deep, deep, rich plum. Now, what colour do we reckon we're going to get for day 25? Yeah. Okay, well, that was not what I was expecting. This is like a pink, but it's got shimmer in it. I would have thought we would have got a red, shimmery red or something, or a shimmery green or something. They certainly missed a trick, didn't they? But yeah. That's Christmas Day. What I would have liked is on Christmas Day if we have a full size or something like that, you know, because this is a it's a £70 calendar and they are all minis. All of them. Now, OPI is an expensive nail polish brand, you know. It is an expensive one. It's not cheap. It's up there along the lines of Essie and um, Nails Inc. So it's quite pricey. Um... But yeah, they are all minis. How much is in each one? Does it say? 3.75 mils. And then in a standard, like this is the Barry M one, there is 10 mil. So they really are minis. They're like a third. You get like a third of the size. Yeah, I don't know. 
Do I like the arrangement of colours? Yes, we have got loads of different colours here, all different from right from pinks to browns to blues to purple. Well, there's not really a blue. There's one blue, bluey green, and then we've got purples. We've got whites. We've got browns or taupey colours and glitters and shimmers and a top and a base coat. Although it's not really a base coat, is it? It's a rapid... Oh, that's the rapid dry top coat. And this is the start to finish two-in-one. Yeah, it's a top and, top and base coat, that one. Um, yeah, it's all right. It's all right. It's not worth 70 quid. I'm glad I didn't pay 70 quid for it. If I had paid 70 quid for it, I'd have been annoyed. But I didn't. I had discount. So, yeah, I think I paid about 55 in the end for it, which I still think is fairly pricey, considering, you know, they're all minis. You don't even get a full-size one for Christmas Day. Yeah, they could do better. But I'm going to enjoy using the nail polishes, so I will get my use out of it. Anyway, that's the end of the video. I do so hope you liked it. If you did, I'd love it if you give me a thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more videos to come. And hopefully I will see you in my next one. Bye for now.